bright lights on us right now, boy. Like, we don't know. <laughs> Pressure on, man, with them balls, man. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And for everybody that don't know you, man, yeah, man. What's good, people, man? It's pressure. Uh, West Side, West Orlando, resident alumni. Um, the bar man, bar man himself. I'm talking about bar for bar. I feel like I can, I can go with the, the industry. The industry. I ain't even gonna, I'm gonna say the industry. Bar for bar. And the best of them. Yes, sir. Battle rap or just um shit. I, I can do that battle shit too, but that shit ain't like yeah, yeah. it ain't what I do. But I can do it. But like bar for bar, as far as like writing, putting songs together. Yes, sir. Got it. And we got we got pressure in the building, man. Said he was gonna say what I was gonna say. I was gonna say, man. I heard you was the bar for bar king out here. Everybody say, man, pressure go against anybody. Only person they only person they hesitate is with Tate. They be like. Pressure the tape. They be uh-huh. like, they be like when they I when it comes down when tape. it come down to the bar. Tate bars. Tate tape put his shit together like how how I put my shit together with them words. Bro like words be really I can tell he take his time to put them bitches together. Yeah, yeah. Them bitches really be here. And that's what I that's what I do. Like I'm I try to make sure a bitch feel that bitch like when they hear it, like mm. Like you ain't just saying Yeah, like anything. I ain't just saying it like mm, okay. Yeah, these days I just hear a whole bunch of punchlines that don't add up. Yeah, hell yeah. Yeah, yeah. This shit gotta add. <laughs> she gotta add up. Hell yeah. <laughs> That's why I was like, man, we gotta have pressure, man. I, I've been trying to reach out to you, but always something come up. Then I was like, man, let me reach out to him. Like, sure, get him, sure. Get him on the show because, like like you said, man, a lot of people don't, when we was in New York, that what they were saying. They were like, the South don't got content in their music. All we got is punchline and our music. That's what they were telling us. And so I content. told him, man, go on the booth with Tate. Man. Uh-huh, for sure. <laughs> go on the booth with Tate, man. He gonna he gonna represent for the South. For sure, so man. They, they they put some stuff together, man. And then like anybody that come our way, mm-hmm. besides Tate, you know, even even I say like, man, pressure pressure one that you gonna put if you come to the city and be like, oh, who got bars? You know, you one that I definitely mm-hmm. like, man. Put big, big. Well, they pull, they pull up and come to the city. <laughs> tell them, pull up. What you think about? They were saying, they were saying, they were saying, Temple. They said Temple coming at the city. Said Temple, 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 talented, Temple, talented. But bro, like real <laughs> shit, like bro, ain't nobody fucking with the city, bro. Orlando versus the world. 
Yeah, bro. Ain't nobody fucking with the city, like, cause I know, like, I'm from here, so ain't no, ain't nobody fucking with the city. I done heard all them rappers all, they cool, but bro, ain't nobody fucking with Orlando. Man, I, th- I think it just speak, speak for itself, man. Like when you go to the city, man, you ain't gonna get, man. We got over like 300 artists in our city that's gonna. Be ready to tear some shit up, man. You ain't going in no yeah, city lot, like that. Of artists, yeah. yeah, it's too. We oversaturated with the artists. For sure. So it's like, yeah, man, that's why we need artists like like you, like artists that had that real content. I think mm-hmm. I think content coming back though. Hell man, yeah. It had left for a minute. They just want to bougie shade. Yeah, bro. See some ass jiggle. But yeah. now niggas niggas want them bars back. Now nah, niggas want to hear nah, for real. Wanna hear some delivery, like some meaning, like nigga. Like me, I, I don't even listen to rap because it it don't got no meaning to it. Yeah. Like little baby came out, he made me start back listening to rap. So he be having some content. In it. For sure. So like a lot of a lot of people don't be having no content. They just be they just about ready to send you up the road. For real. Like I had like, <laughs> like I, said, I put some shit on um, IG the other day. I had posted some shit talking about like ain't no more motivation. Like remember when the music used to motivate a nigga. Nigga used to listen to a track and nigga want to go get a whole, go get a whole sack, go get a million, Damn. go chase it. Now it's like nigga listen to a song, nigga ready to go bust a nigga head. Like I'm talking about, exactly. It's like it's it's almost like like crash dummy like music. Like that's all it's like out motivating of. the niggas who gonna really crash out and niggas really tricking niggas off the street with music. Exactly, it's crazy. Niggas ain't even talking about the bad. Now I can say on. Um, Another person I listen to is on um, bank account, Big Pat. He from um, Polk County. Shout out, Big Pat. Now he make. I gotta check him out. Yeah, yeah, check bank account. He gonna make you go get that bag, right? That's all he talking about. That set. He, yeah, for real. Like, like Dolph, 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 Dolph used to talk about it. He, he don't kind of, you mm-hmm. know, with that beef shit. He, he kind of went into like talking about that beef shit. But Dolph used to make you like that 16, 16 zips. That, See, I feel like I feel like if 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 the rap. Ain't up to par, and I ain't gonna say up to par, but you ain't like on no level like with the niggas who really spitting. You got to be talking about something that a nigga can relate to for a nigga to really grasp, grasp the music and listen to you. You just can't be on like like the one. What's the one nigga who just got signed? Um, damn, what's the nigga name? Nigga from Florida got signed by Rock Nation. Hmm. No, 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 no. Fish scale, Fish bro. Scale. Ain't no no goddamn. Hell of a rapper, but he talking about some real shit, and the nigga can. I ain't listen to him yet. And the nigga can really, I really know that he talking what he talking. He really know it. what he talking about. Yeah, 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 you can feel it. Yeah, yeah, I ain't, I ain't, I ain't listen to this. <coughs> I, I heard a lot of Byron though, but I ain't, I ain't tuned in. Like I said, I don't. A, a lot of times I don't be listening to rap because it's already all of it sound the same. Yeah, I, I do. be like, man, that shit. I don't be want to hear that shit. You sound just like the next nigga. Show. So I don't really be listening to rap. I be listening to like R and B and shit. <laughs> That's why I try to like. I sw- it's basically the beats, bro. Like the the production is really what's gonna take the song where it gotta go. Like if the production sound the same, the music gonna always sound the same. Like people, we need to start stepping out of the that Comfort same zone. beat pattern. That same. It's gonna if it's if it sound like that beat, it's gonna sound the same. Even if a nigga talking about something, it's still gonna sound the same. Because See, we the live in, but we live in a generation where people, all right. So say like say Fisk or say they listen to his style of rap. So mm-hmm. since he buzzing, everybody want to sound like him. Yeah, yeah. You live in that type of generation. Oh yeah. So like it ain't like people want to find their own identity. For sure. You get what I'm saying? Back in the days, you listen to Nas. Nas don't sound like Jay Z. Jay Z don't no. sound like Fifty. Everybody. You listening to these people because exactly you get what I'm saying. It's like these days, everybody trying to sound like this person because everybody just chasing the wave. They ain't really yeah for sure. You know, they ain't really chasing. You know, they ain't really chasing the talent like this on their art. And some of them, I don't blame some of them because the young ones they don't really know no better. Like the, when they came up, they was listening to like they was through into it. So it's like. When you threw into something like your environment, like yeah, basically, yeah, it. when you born into <laughs> it, it's like, hey, this is what they gave me. This is what yeah. they fed me. So yeah. this is what I know. So like a lot of the new generation, they wanted to sound like Kodak. Yo, yeah, bro, that's that's all they know. Some of these new cats don't even know who 8-Ball MJG <laughs> is. Like, bro, I guarantee I ask my live right now, and there's probably five people probably know who 8-Ball MJG is. From the South? 
Nah, they the got know A ball and JG. They don't, bro. The young cats don't know who it is. But if I ask them who is, I know A ball and JG. The younger generation. And they gotta know A ball, man. The young generation. You'd be surprised, bro. They so they stop at trick. I'm talking about these just who own yeah, right now, like. The 19, so they stopped at Trick Daddy. So they, that's all. Man, some of them probably don't even know who Trick is. <laughs> I promise, bro. Bro, I be asking, I be asking my little cousin them. I be like, I be like, Jit, what y'all know about this? He would be like, what that is? <laughs> like, damn, damn, they don't know about Trick. <laughs> but that's the that. Yeah, a lot of people don't know about UGK though. A lot of people don't know about UGK. UGK is like, well, you don't win in the cut. <laughs> you gotta, be, <laughs> you gotta really be a fan of this shit. <laughs> Pimp C used to, cause I really yeah. like right now. I really, I ain't gonna tell you no lie. I used to just rock UGK cause they, they just had that down south. Like you got bang in your car, they just had yeah. that right, you know, mm-hmm. music for that bang. So a lot of time, I just used to just listen to UGK just for the um. For they for the they beat yeah for the bass, but then now that I got older, I went back and be listening to Pimp C. I'm like, damn, these niggas was spitting those. That nigga was spitting game. Like that nigga was telling some truth. Yeah, Pimp C was on yeah, some shit. I was like, yeah. damn, but he yeah, Pimp C was harder than Bun. But like I said back then, Bun used to flow like Pimp C. He he go off beat sometimes, but you just gotta pay attention to his words. Mm-hmm. But yeah, yeah, but Bun, Bun gonna flow. That's what I'm saying. Like, you got artists that know how to flow on the beat. Mm-hmm. They really ain't saying nothing. They just flowing with the beat. And then you got artists that fuck the beat. They gonna out rap the beat. You know what I'm saying? They gonna out rap that motherfucker, bro. <laughs> but people don't even know what that means. Like, how can you out, out rap the beat? You know <laughs> That's a lot of niggas. <laughs> well, Bill, they'll be like, Bill, what is the beat, Bill? <laughs> For real. They don't even know. Like, what? What? What's another one of your songs we could play right now? Let them know. Um, like, what we talking about? Shit. Uh, damn. What try? What I got on YouTube? I ain't got no video of that shit. I think I, I sent something to you. I had sent that. Uh, that crazy. I'm kind of stepping out. Stepping out. Yeah. I, I, what I what I normally do, but it's still some. Some content to it, you feel me? How you feel like Orlando treat you as an artist? Uh, I feel like, like I said, bro, like, it's not, now it's getting younger. Like, it's getting younger and younger. So, I wouldn't expect all, all of them to know who I am, you feel me? Yeah, yeah. But, like, as far as my peers, I feel like I'm well, well respected. Yeah. Like, with the people around who know me around my age and around that, um, that year when I was really going in, I, mm-hmm. I really feel like I'm... I'm respected as far as that is with the artists. Yo, what about like the D? I'm talking about like far as like with the culture at all. Like with the culture, like DJ, artists, promoters, the everybody. DJs, man. The DJs, it's, we got a we got a love hate <laughs> relationship, man. Because it's like uh, it's like they fuck with a nigga, but I guess I guess it's like somewhat like sometimes a nigga will be sporadic with the music like you feel me like come in and come out and go go do this go do that so i, I feel like they don't feel like a nigga really serious oh so but, you ain't um, been you ain't been consistent yeah yeah they don't, they don't feel like a nigga consistent yeah yeah right now this 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 push that a nigga finna make right now is you like consistent they're gonna have to they're gonna have to they're gonna have to if, if they don't then they don't but they're gonna have to because it's, it's, it's about to get real so it's like yeah, I feel like I that. I, DJs, feel, I feel like that with you too, though. I be going on your page trying to find stuff. Yeah. Like, damn, what, what pressure doing, man? Yeah, yeah. I went, <laughs> man. Wait, wait, yeah. In the lab or something, man. Yeah, for real. Man, I went. That's back. what a lot of people tell me, bro. So I have to, I had to tighten up. Yeah, you can't put that, that dope. You can't put that good dope out there and then take it away. You know yeah, what yeah. Saying? Cause then they the, not, bro. Yeah, cause the jewels they <laughs> gonna they want to smoke, so they gonna get For used real. to that water base. They don't care what it is. They <laughs> I <just> swear. <laughs> so when you do come back with it, they gonna be already. Yeah, they oh, can't bro, give it, bro. Giving me seventy for, <laughs> for twenty five, bitch. Bitch, we don't want that iron no more, bitch. <laughs> yeah. I don't want that straight drop. <laughs> For real. Just want to go in the club, shake my ass, and go home. Shit. For real, that's how it is, for real. I swear that's how it is. 
You know, made me lose my conscious mind. Fuck that mind. Nah, but I'm here. I'm here now, bro. And it's it's go. It's it's all good. All right, y'all heard it from pressure, man. Right here on do what you want to do radio, man. He say he finna jump on y'all neck, man. Break, like, break, break line is cut. All right. This don't even work. <laughs> <laughs> that bit don't work no more. For y'all don't know what he, we about to play something right now from for y'all that just tuning in and don't really know who pressure is. This joint called crazy man. It's basically like feel I feel like it's it's my my pers- my perception of what's going on, like what's going on in the world today. And it's a hard ass track. That shit that shit hard, man. Straight to get that DC number. Straight <laughs> to get the DC number, man. Like the, the trick them off the streets EP. Trick them off the street EP, man. I'm talking about that. Like, man, I be, <laughs> man, I be watching the little thing that on YouTube it be showing them niggas that be crashing out. It be showing them in court on YouTube, and like when they get their time, how they be going crazy and shit. Hell, niggas be, like, be the killers out there. Those niggas be screaming, Ma! <laughs> they like, crash at 30 years. Sometimes crash be talking about life plus 30. It be like, yeah, this bro. your first charge. It crash at life plus 30. You you can't even calculate. You can't even calculate that time in your head. You, and you looking crazy. like Martin off life. Like, what do you say? It's crazy that a lot, a, lot of, a lot of the young niggas who really, who out here, like, in the streets, they don't even like realize that that bro, if you gonna be out here like that, you gotta you gotta have shit set up in situations because shit happen. So a lot of these niggas don't be having no lawyer money. A lot of these niggas don't be knowing what the 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 people to hit up. They don't and, even know how much. Man, a, they don't even know how much a murder case costs listen, for bro. a lawyer. Like that shit, eighty thousand just to just for a lawyer to take your case for a murder. Bro, you gotta you gotta be prepared. You gotta be prepared and, and shit like this, cause like especially in the in the in the world that we living in, 
motherfucking police getting smarter because niggas telling them everything. So it's like, bitch, we on IG giving all the game. These people on IG soaking up all the game, so it's getting easier for them. So like, you gotta have you gotta have that shit ready, bro. Cause that's if you out there here first, the <laughs> shit gonna happen. It's yeah. gonna happen if you really out there. If you really out some there, of these, some of these niggas don't even be having. They be going to court with a PD. Yeah, going. Like, yeah, going to Kentucky. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, going that bill with a PD. Yeah, going to Kentucky Federal <laughs> Kentucky Correctionals, bill. He's sending yeah, yeah to to Maine, bill. They sending they had the federal now for them guns. They ain't the feds picking up them gun cases now. Like you ain't like the county could drop your gun charge and the feds pick that shit up now. So it's, it's too many. It's too many, of them, bro. Them people scared, bro. Them, bro, them people be seeing all them goddamn. You talking about the people and, scared? I was scared. Shit, I, I, I was scared. About, all them goddamn goddamn all these damn old little kids with guns with no with no direction. I was scared of them motherfuckers. Big can't even aim. Big on big on shoot everything. Yeah, Man, listen, let some just pull up on the side of my car. Bitch, I'm running red light and everything. <laughs> I was playing this. I, was playing, I had to take that little $100, $200 ticket, man. Sure. I ain't playing. He just shooting up shit for no reason. And the crazy yo, yo. thing now, a couple of these just shooting up shit, and then they'll turn themselves in. They'll be gonna kill somebody and turn themselves in in two weeks. You'll be like, boy, you just took a body. You know, took a life for... For no reason. <laughs> Crazy. That's Jones why. I, ain't gonna understand that apology. That go back to that shit I said. Like they, this the shit that they were born in. Mm-hmm. They were born on. They were born in on that wreck out shit. So yeah, I guess so. That's man. all. That's all they know. Until somebody, until somebody like grab them and let them know a, a touch I, them with I, the music. I blame it on the. I blame it on the. Um, put your mic like this. I, I blame it on the um video games though. Yeah. And I sat down with my stepkid and seen that um what that did they be playing GTA shit or oh, that Fortnite? That Fortnite it's like a shooting game. Yeah, Fortnite. Yeah, boy, I was like, and he <laughs> them kill a little too real and them niggas excited about it. I'm like, <laughs> oh yeah, yeah Call, Call of Duty. Duty. That's yeah. what I'm talking about. Call of Duty. The war zone shit. Yeah, boy, them boys ain't playing. Boy, he he sniper and shit. And I'm talking about. Stepson in that bitch. I see why he don't want to come out the room. That nigga in that bitch like, <laughs> like he the man. Like he a straight head honcho. He in that. Hey man, hit the back door. I'm finna hit the front. Da, da, da. I got him head shot. I'm finna hit. And I was talking about come out and do it. I be like, I'm looking at him like, hey, you will not find out where my guns at. <laughs> not at all. Yeah. So it's like they. It's so. Nah, but it looks so real. Like it. It make them immune to death. So it's like yeah. they'll come out in real life and do that shit and not knowing like it's other consequences that come like you can't turn this game off and be like, Alright, I'm hungry. Like when For you real. headshot this nigga's like a whole crime sc- scene finna pull up, whole investigation finna come on, D cracking finna come to your door. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. It's a whole like I said, you, you ain't even got no money for a lawyer. You probably ain't got yeah. money to bond out. You get what I'm saying? No, I feel like I feel like that shit part of that shit part of the the bigger scheme too, bro. Cause like that virtual reality shit, basically all they trying to do, bro, with these kids with that virtual reality is is fuck up their perception of what's real. So if you if you take something and you give it to somebody so much, and this all they know, eventually, bro, that shit is gonna become the norm. So they got these kids with all these games and shit. They killing motherfuckers. They making it. They seeing motherfuckers getting killed on Instagram. Bitches getting choked on Instagram to death. They getting shot on Instagram, Facebook. When you when you put it in like that, it become it become their reality. So now it's like, oh, that ain't shit. But I feel like that's what's being pushed to the to the yeah, youth. Yeah, and the reason why it's being pushed to the youth because this is what the government wins with with the ghetto kids. They gonna be pushed to the streets to kill each other really? for the corporate kids or kids that are raised with with some common sense. They gonna be pushed to go to the army. Mm-hmm. You get what I'm saying? Because now they really want to live like this. Like, so what the best place to go kill people for free? Go to the army. For sure. 
Nah, exactly. That what I'm saying. When kids want to see these guns and shoot these, but they don't want the consequence, they gonna go to the army. So yeah. the government win both ways. Like you come, yeah, come fight these wars with me. You can shoot, yes. you can shoot. And then as you so skillful in the game, shit, they really need you in the army because if you could do it in the game, shit, that's all you need to do. Bro, all I exactly. You get what I'm saying? So. Exactly. So all I had to all I had to hear, bro, when it was a couple of years back, this is all I had to hear to know that they with the fuck shit. Um, <laughs> the, yeah, yeah, to know that it's it's all it's all they with the fuckery, bro. <laughs> they signed they signed the um the prisons signed some shit with the music and with with a big with a big mute with a big a big music label, bro. Mm-hmm. Like as far as the music, it was basically like. They was trying to get the music to into push the, the violence into the prisons to fund the prisons, and they was the money was going like in a circle, bro. So it was like we gonna buy them. A couple judges got yeah. got locked up for that shit too, cause they was selling them jits to like the camps and shit. Yeah, yeah. When I when I when I, I heard I that shit and about. I seen that shit, bro, I was like, bro, this shit is this shit is like a game to them. Like this shit is really yeah. like people really sitting back like laughing like. Ha, 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 like, yeah, for, for the government, for the government, when you're in prison, that's the only slavery they could get. Like Shit, that's, that's modern day slavery. So yeah, yeah. they got they, yeah. So they, yeah. So they got, so they got people. So like, anytime you go to the prison, they get paid for you for being in prison off real, and they also make you work. And do like shit for the government. That's why you see like the prison oh, okay. system outside cleaning the roads. They don't got to pay nobody to do that. You get what I'm they give like fifteen cent an hour. Or some they shit ain't like giving that. them nothing. They giving them ten ten days ten days off their sentence. Uh, game off time. Yeah, that game time. You ain't getting one dollar. <laughs> crazy. <laughs> yeah, that getting, shit legal. Yeah, that shit legal. So. <laughs> That's crazy. So imagine they gotta they gotta keep the prison full. Then you gotta understand the commissary. They. They selling you a honey bun, two dollars for a honey bun. You get what I'm saying? So imagine the the people that own that, the t shirt, all that shit. You get what I'm saying? Like the prison, the prison market. Like I ain't gonna lie, if I had enough money, I would get in it. <laughs> I ain't gonna tell you no lie. Yeah, it's a, lot it's of a money, guarantee. Man. It's a guarantee. It's a win win situation. You ain't gonna lose investing money in the prison system. That shit gonna. Exactly. So that's that why they Jordan invested in that shit too. Man, Jordan it's a lot. In a lot of you hear what I said? If I have money to invest in the prison system, I'm gonna invest. I don't give a fuck. What a bitch call me, bitch. I'm gonna invest. You feel what I'm saying? Because yeah, it's a guaranteed. non-stop. It's a non-stop. It's 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 better than a hospital. Yeah. You feel what I'm saying? It's like, and then they set it up. Well, like you said, they push rap and all that shit. Yeah. You gotta understand, like the the people that's at the top, they own mostly all your company. Like they own all the Target, they own everything. So it's like, yeah, they own the big record labels too. You get what I'm saying? So yeah, they gonna push, yeah, push that violence, push that garlic come right sure. back to to they to they pocket, and they enslave more of us. Mm-hmm. And the more they enslave us, the more beneficial they are. If you look at that shit, it's like I I say it's like eighty five percent. Of the, of the niggas that's on is speaking about that retarded shit, like go kill a bitch shit, and it's like fifteen percent that really that's really got some content in the industry right now. Like if you turn on, if you go to everybody who signed, who signed to a label, a big label with some money, eighty five percent of their ass on some shit. I'm gonna spin it, spin, spin, and fifteen percent actually on some content. And then that shit crazy. It ain't crazy because it's money. Because at the end of the day, they 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 gonna go to what's making the most money. So you can't blame them because they just trying to get the money. But that's why that's why I always was kind of like an R and B fan, even in the nineties. Because most of the time, you listen to interviews and you listen to these rappers, they'll be like, "I rap, but I don't let my kids listen to it." You get what I'm saying? So you used to always throw me off. Like, what the fuck he talking about? Like, you going to rap to me. You ain't going to let your kids, but you going to let me listen to it, right? Nah, certain people, certain artists, they, they don't even let their kids listen to rap, period. Not in their house. 
Are you gonna go listen to Tupac till I was in the ninth grade, my freshman year? I mean, I heard, I listened to him, but I, my parents, my dad, wouldn't let me listen to him until high school. But after yeah. that, I mean, shit. but even two, but even Tupac, like I ain't, like I listen to Tupac, I fuck with him, but I always knew as a, I don't know, like me, even A Ball and MJG, like I listen to them. But even in their raps, they'll say like they not on the block. So it's like when I like when I listen to them, and back then I you I was on the block like two three in the morning. I had to go on the block even when I ain't feel like going on the block just to make some money. So it's like listening to these niggas was aggravating. You feel what I'm saying? Cause it's like nigga, I'm out here two in the morning, three in the morning, and you rapping about this, but you probably in the studio doing some shit. That's why back in the days. Niggas in the streets ain't respect rappers. But probably at one point in time they was doing it, and then they reached a certain point to where they kind of like sit that shit down and do some other shit. Invest so not too like too pop. Pop told like pop you. Pop, a... pop told you he just was rapping about people's stories. Yeah. You get what I'm saying? So like that kind of like made me respect them a little bit more. You get what I'm saying? Because he came out and was like, you know, I I wasn't in the streets. I tried to do the street shit, but that shit ain't work out for me. So I just rap stories. So that that made me like respect what he, you know what I'm talking about? Because like even if you write a book or something, it may mm-hmm. not be all your story. So right. you know, you telling another person's story ain't ain't really a lie. You get what I'm saying? Like if you came up and your dad sold dope and you rapping about like the dope life, it ain't really sure. a lie. It's just you ain't sold it. Right. You get what I'm saying? So I don't knock nobody that rap like that. You get what I'm saying? Like it just don't. I just feel like don't don't put nobody in a situation that you don't, that you you not in. You feel what I'm saying? Like just for a check, it ain't worth it. Like a lot of a lot of artists, like they'll say they won't let their kids listen to it, but they'll go and rap it. Let like other people's kids listen. to Exactly. It. So it's like don't rap that yourself. shit. You ain't gonna let your kids mm-hmm. listen to it. Don't let nobody else's kids listen to that shit. Bro, I feel I feel like I feel like it's a it's a um like with this music shit right. Like this shit go deeper than like just here, like how we is right now. So I feel like when you make music, for instance, if you make music that influence a motherfucker to go really hurt somebody, or you or take from somebody or do something to somebody, I feel like that's on you. Like yeah, I feel like that's on, on your soul. Like yeah, blood on you. yeah, so when I do music, I, I take yeah. that I take that into into consideration too, bro, because. Like that shit, like the tongue, bro. Like, like you can really speak some shit. Yeah, yeah. You can really speak some shit into some shit channel. for yeah, real. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So with the music, just imagine if you got a big, if you got a big audience. Yeah. So my, just my voice, I might have my my followers listen to me, a couple thousand people. But you got some people that got millions of people. Mm-hmm. So that means you speaking this into millions mm-hmm. of souls, bro. So I feel like that shit. Like it's 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 yeah, dirt. It, it become dirt and mud on your shit, bro. Yeah, when it's like not eventually. calculated. Yeah, yeah, bro. It definitely should be calculated. But people ain't. That's what I'm saying. Like a lot of people is just in it for the money. Like you hear it. Like you gotta just listen to them when they talk. A lot of people is like, I don't give a fuck. Like that's what I'm saying. Like yeah. they won't let their kids listen to it, but they'll let other people kids listen to it. And it's bro, like I don't give. He a, said that he ain't let Romeo listen to his music. His music coming up, a lot of man, a, a lot of a lot of artists, a lot of people, not just artists, a lot of people in the industry. Period is like that. It's just like it's just like a dope boy. A lot of dope boys won't let their kids see what they do, but they'll sell drugs to somebody else's kids. For real, you get what I'm saying? It's like shit fucked up. <laughs> Life is though. It, <laughs> That's how it is. I get it, hey. Huh? That's what they say. Money is the root of all evil. How Q? How how y'all Cube. feel about Q moving? Q Q. Nothing wrong. No, he talking about. Feel like he did. What he did? Hmm. Talking about the little league and shit. This um this trick. That's smart. Why not? Yeah. You can say, go sit say, down with both parties. Move up. You ain't in the camera. How he ain't up. sell out though? Yeah, you gotta push the chip. Mm hmm. What you talking about with like, Q supporting Trump? No, it, yeah, yeah. he ain't supporting Trump. 
He just I sat down with him and had a conversation oh, with him. Nah, I just seen a he, meme. He I seen a, I seen a meme. Us. I seen a you. meme with a Trump hat on. Yeah, no, human. No, that was fake. Oh, that was fake. <laughs> Yeah, then, I ain't really yeah, paying no yeah, attention to. Oh, all right. Now, but I heard a CNN interview with him talking to the CNN dude about about about. He said he was taking both sides. I mean, he ain't taking no side. Just whoever gonna support what he got going on. Correct. Well, That's what he said. It's Trump is Trump. Bro. But but at the end of the day, but y'all ain't here listening to Cube. Cube Cube saying this because he trying to promote. He trying to produce some movies. So that what he said. He was like, whoever gonna push, whoever gonna push. But in his contract, he got something, to, something about black people, black people making movies. No, nah, I'm just talking about for for them to have certain rights over their movies and to get their movies, you know, produced and stuff like that. So like, man, everybody got. People ain't gonna vote for one that one buddy, bro. I don't just know, man. I ain't gonna say my opinion on it. <laughs> But tax, they said they said dude, man. Oh, no, no, I ain't even saying. I ain't plan, fucking with that. A tax plan you know, he got. <laughs> I ain't fucking a with lot of politics. people, bro, who getting money. A lot of people ain't ain't really fucking with buddy because, bro. Only thing I can say this year, man, is a lot of money, bro. That's that's but basically that, yeah. Bro, that's basically wrong. Talking about the other dude, him. right? Yo, bro. Hey, million. hey, this is what I'm trying to tell y'all. Y'all better, no, better watch that other dude. Y'all talking about fuck Y'all better watch that other dude. That other dude, 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 dude got some tricks up his sleeve. Yeah, yeah, bro, you, can you imagine getting a <laughs> $3 million? Bro, can you <laughs> imagine <laughs> somebody getting, getting paid a he million dollars? He got some shit up his sleeve. Uh, um, y'all keep and fucking with him. I don't know, bro. We at the end of time, man. I'm like, fuck it. We in a lose-lose situation. Listen. The other dude, what his name is, Joe Biden. Y'all gotta watch him, man. I ain't, I ain't gonna pick no sides, but I'm like, I'm like, I'm like IQ. Watch him, man. Watch both of them. But with Trump, we listen, listen with Trump. Listen, one thing with Trump this year, if you was in business or whatever, everybody ate. Ain't nobody, can't nobody really complain. Trump let the nigga eat. <laughs> nigga was racist, but he let you eat. <laughs> this other dude y'all talking about y'all getting blinded by Trump campaign and gonna just run to this next dude man this next dude is tripping y'all ain't hear what he wants no, in the past five years listen, in the presidential debate he only paid seven hundred. no but this dude is this dude is tripping this dude is I'm not gonna say what he wanna do y'all gotta study what he trying to do but y'all better study what he trying to do cause he finna make the world so fucked up that y'all gonna wish Trump was president. Come on, the other dude. The other dude, he finna fuck shit up. He wild, I can tell he wild. That nigga fucking shit up. I already seen some of the shit he trying to approve. That's why November second, man. Y'all think this? Nigga, he gonna have. He gonna have. Y'all think we got skinny jeans? I'm just gonna throw this out there. He gonna have new walking around with spandex. Oh, what? <laughs> Oh, shit. I just gonna throw that out there. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, man. Throw that. Y'all been here studying. Well, a lot of that, a lot of that shit, a lot of that shit, um, a lot of that shit that they be passing, bro, be like shit that they they be trying to get favors from other people. So it's probably a lot of it's probably a lot of politicians mm -hmm. and shit that be on that kind of shit, and he just trying to like get they. Because they can't, the president ain't, don't do shit. Nah, nah. They that just, shit got to go through the house. Yeah. Like, they got to build a relationship with them people. So, a lot of them people be like that. Yeah. Like, it be a lot of them that be low-key to be on, like. Yeah, yeah, that fuck yeah, you. Yeah, yeah. So, that's what I'm trying they, to they be trying to get on their side. Like, but that's what I'm going to pass this and yeah, pass that. That's yeah. what I'm saying. Why? Y'all think I'm, you know, I'm not joking. About, I'm telling you. you just know, study what he's trying to pass. I'm not, I don't want to say it on air because. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I yeah, feel you. But, we wearing skinny jeans. He making he want us to wear tights. I'm just gonna say that. And hey, you know, once they pass a law, they can't they can't take it away. They can only revise it. That's shit it. Crazy. Like the gay shit, they can't like like He's take that shit that. away. I'm, I'm saying. not saying anything. <laughs> That's reality. Y'all living in the U.S., don't y'all? <laughs> yeah. I'm just saying. You we saying <laughs> they gonna keep your, they gonna keep your heart, your ass. They can't change that law. They could make it to where they could probably be together, but they can't like, get married. They can revise it, but they can't take it away. 
Hey man, I'm just telling y'all, man. Y'all don't want to wear no tights. Pass. Who got that low pants? Listen, they already got pants. Like some stores, you can't even buy regular jeans that feel like jeans. They already feel like spandex when you buy them. They call it stretch. A lot of that, what you call the shit? That um. So this that present- designer shit, bro. That designer <laughs> niggas don't know, bro. Like. Uh, most of that designer shit is that way. Like them people <laughs> like that. Like, Cause they like the, main design, there, though. the main designers. That's they how they smaller, use. Though. Like yeah, the Dior's yeah. and the and the and all, bro, them people really like that. They really like, like that. Yeah, they really living like that. So it's like, yeah, like for real. Like that's so. Eventually, the clothes, the clothes are gonna get more like to what they is because that's how. That's how they. That's who running it. If you own that company and you like that, of course you are gonna make your shit a little bit skinnier. Look, make it look a like it, it's a older. purse or something. It's it's really gonna it's yeah. really gonna go that way. It really gonna be spandex. And now they, the government <laughs> like starting those, to accept it more. Those pouches, man. Those pouches. They done brought them. They done brought them back. <laughs> they done brought them back. T Black, what's up? Are you man? talking about uh, Fanny Pack, bro? Damn, I ain't call it that. I ain't say that. That's what, what, it's, what it's called again? A fanny pack. But it just, everybody be wearing it, bro. Yeah. Everybody be wearing it. Ain't nothing wrong with it. Shit, I wear it. I that ain't Gucci. That's, that's Jordan. Y'all don't fuck with Jordan? Man, don't Jordan, set you up. Don't, you Jordan don't wear you. tight shit. Yeah. <laughs> I just keep it because I don't like having a whole bunch of stuff in my pocket, so I just put everything in bro, The whole time you was in the car, he was like, don't man, what you call it? Man, what you call the whole time you was in the car, he, he could have told you to leave that in the car. He like, man, I'm going to talk on that. That design, that design if, you, if, you go to, if you go look at them designers, like, if you look at one of their shows, like the fashion show, like the shit, that, the, the shit that we buy, like, from the stores, really don't make them people no money. Them people don't make money off that. Them people make money off... When these people buy these goddamn dresses that's $19,000, that's when they making their money. Them little, them little Gucci pants that we buy, little shirts that we buy, that shit ain't making them no money. So, like, when you if you really go look at one of their shows, like a Europe show, a Europe runway Gucci, you'll be like, what the fuck? <laughs> that's that shit LeBron That's, that's Gucci, like, you feel uh, me? You wear a suit jacket what? with some damn shorts. Man, I seen I seen a, a runway show a bit had on some tape, like some dress pants, like some duct tape, bro. <laughs> like wrapped around them, bro. Oh. Like with a with a see through visor <laughs> and like a, and like a metal purse, bro. Like this yeah. shit, that's the kind of shit they own, bro. Right. That shit, they just they just push that urban shit to the black people because they know we gonna buy that shit. But they really own some wild shit like that designer <laughs> shit. Oh, for yeah, real, they for don't, real. They don't be, for it too, nah, they don't be playing, shit. man. But that's that's that's. I don't know, man. Y'all tripping. Who the, the that's black, T Black, that's T -Black man. right hey, here, so man? Look, hey, <laughs> T Black. I reached out. Look. I reached out to him last week, probably like Tuesday. No, no, no. About Wednesday or Thursday, I get on damn Instagram Saturday and spook going in on you, bro. What's up with that? <laughs> Oh, cause I, cause I had um, cause I had crack on. Oh, that's the one that was yeah. going on, bro, for I a whole that. hour. Yeah, he oh, that yeah, yeah, for I a see. long ass time. He did that been fast a too. A whole <laughs> hour. Hey, why you ain't joining the live though? Oh, cause I was gone. I had with grocery shopping and shit. And my phone oh yeah, gone. I seen that shit. I ain't know who you was going off for. <laughs> yeah, I ain't know. That's you. I saw oh. when I got home though. A lot of people had text my ass for a whole hour. hour. Bro, I'm like, what the fuck? How did this happen? I told you Thursday, this shit happened Saturday. So I'm like, okay, fuck it. Guess we gonna bring it up. Why he'll find you up? You said and something I to him? Find it, I... <laughs> what you said to him? Huh? What you said to him? Hey, man, spook, man. Oh, Where you at, man? That. Why you why you find people up, man? Bro, for a whole hour. Can we play a clip? Like, maybe two minutes? It's on YouTube. You put it on YouTube? Bro, that bitch a whole hour cake. It got like five commercials through that bitch. He definitely getting paid for it. Shout out to that boy Spook. Hey, boy. Spook. He went in for a whole hour. Now I seen, I was watching, I think he had it on live or on his on his page or on his store. I went and watched it. Bro, he got a whole Oh, yeah, you on. tagged me in it. Yeah. Yeah, I was like, damn. How many views he got on that? A lot. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, he got a lot on that bitch. Like, about 10, 11,000. I only got 1,000 views on mine. <laughs> what you, what, why you started with him? Because I felt like that's what I was doing. You just you scrolled through a picture up? and was like, damn, damn, damn. Huh? You just fired people up? Yeah. When I'm bored. Oh, you did do another nigga too, I did didn't you? I like three people. 
Did they reply? Uh, yeah, they did. Both of <laughs> yeah. Damn, I gotta go that's see what, this. They that's what you trying to do. You try, that's what you trying to make that like. Know what you like do? That part of what you, you rap or you? Yeah, I'm a rap. I, I do both. Yeah, I feel you. Oh, you shit. fire you people mean? up and you do and you yeah, do and rap. rap. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Oh, all right. Damn, I. How long you been rapping? Damn, I wish I would have huh? known that. How long you been rapping, bro? You gotta watch I, the video. I've been rapping since I was like. I seen the video with Spook. For a whole hour. Yeah. Oh, you ain't hear him? Nah, he is. It's only like a minute on his page. I, I listened. I, I I seen the one with Spook. That shit go hand in hand though, man. That music, comedy, sports, all that shit tied in. Yeah, all Fashion, that shit. All that shit. We all one, man. Yeah. That's why rappers want to be ball player. Ball player want to be rappers, comedians. For real, all it just, that shit. It's just the thing. It's just the thing. Actors. With, it's just, yeah, that shit tied to it. It's just the thing with 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 certain artists. You can't you can't joke around. Cause certain artists don't play. Yeah, yeah, like, but like, that that you that, feel that. what I'm saying? Like certain artists don't even joke with their friends or their family. Like mm-hmm. I'm one of the type of people. Like I don't even. I ain't crack. Like I crack joke with with like certain people. But I don't even. I don't even know that crack yeah, joke. I feel like I feel like in that in that. Joke, that kind of situation, head, if you ain't never, if you ain't never been in the presence of me and you seen me doing no shit like that, don't be the first one to try to act like, like, it's try cool. to put it and make it seem like it's cool, to, like to Listen, do it to don't me. Make no, like, make if you ain't never seen it, yeah, like, man. just don't, just don't, don't be the first one. Like, <laughs> like if you see me like I and you see a nigga doing some crazy shit or some, then okay, you see me doing, you see some me doing some shit. shit. But if you ain't, you don't even know me. Yeah, don't, don't, be no, don't, no don't play with me. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> See, that's what I'm telling you, man. That's why, that why down south ain't good for battle rap. We oh, yeah, for the real. The west side ain't... East side might... You might be okay with the east side. Oh, yeah, they gonna battle your ass yeah. up, bro. And they gonna, west leave, side, it, west they gonna side. leave it up to the music on on the east side. West side, you gonna get your ass fired up, man. Your ass ain't gonna yeah, leave that side. building. <laughs> they ain't gonna shoot your ass in your face, that man. They really living. They really own that shit, man. Nah, it's just the fact that we don't it's joke. Like, it ain't, we ain't like, do you do you even look in that clothes? Like, we don't even too much dance. Like, niggas, be, niggas be just head vibing. bobbing. <clears throat> if a nigga crunk, nigga crunk with their own click. You feel what I'm saying? Niggas ain't really on that. Man, if a nigga dancing in Orlando club, a nigga on some drugs. <laughs> <laughs> you should like, I'll be real with you. I if think you that's see a nigga in the club, back. if a nigga really dancing like, and a nigga like sweating dancing, on nigga some on some or Chris something. Brown right? types. Nah, nah, Yo. you ain't gonna see that in Orlando. Nah. Now Temple, you might see, you might, you, you might see them juke a little bit, but in Orlando, <laughs> you see a bit juke. <laughs> He on the beam, I promise, bro. The, the niggas be, oh, man, niggas the DJ, the the DJ might stop the music. He's still going. He's still juking. For instance, uh, beat him, bro. Monkey Man. Yeah. Monkey Man go retarded and beat him all Rosemont. night. Yeah, he from Rosemont. He be juking. Yeah. What? You juking? Juking ain't the word. <laughs> Bro, from when they first play the first song <laughs> until the last song, it's turn up the whole night. That's the only person in Orlando. Shout out to Monkey Man. Yeah. Bro, gonna turn up the whole night, nonstop, sweat rag, <laughs> the whole night. Hey, for real. But I tell a nigga quit, man. You ain't gonna find too many in the, in the city that gonna joke. <clears throat> Them niggas in Tampa and Jacksonville, they joke in prison. So you know, them niggas just be joking. Yo nigga, boy, you put on a little beat, you go to hear that bump, what well, nigga finna go to <laughs> nigga gonna finna go to pop it. <laughs> like, what the fuck? <laughs> I just This nigga but, T Black, man. I heard you got a nickname. He man. on your ass. Why T-Black, they call you one shot? I heard they call you one shot. <laughs> man, but that man don't I don't know why that. You get that? that. <laughs> he don't know my name so. So he just called me all Who that? Spook? I don't know that I don't tell him my name. Who? Why they call you one shot? I don't know, bro. And then they came with the bullshit. <laughs> he done brought you here with the bullshit. <laughs> then I mean, they y'all hear this then song. Then they like, jump in the car. I want to beat you up. Come on, man. And you jump in the car with the fanny pack. Like, oh, yeah, I got it. So as soon as he got more in. No, you don't want to have you come in with the name of uh, one shot. I don't know, bro. He just started calling me that, bro. He just... Sh- I don't know shit that like that. I didn't want to tell him my real name, so I just went. See, see why niggas don't joke? 
That's why I need to know a joke, man. In my era, boy, you got to know how to fight the joke. Boy. I ain't going to tell you no lie, boy. <laughs> Nigga be on that school, but joking, boy. You don't know how to fight, boy. That's going to be the end of the joke. <laughs> I know how to fight. That's why I be joking. <laughs> Niggas be going to get on that ass, boy. Tell him what's Niggas going to get on the people that laughing first. Like, they're going to hit the nigga that laughing the hardest first. Then they're going to get on your ass, boy. You got to know how that's to fight. That's the first person to get picked, the one, picked on. The one that's laughing too Boy, hard. that school bus, I don't see so, I don't see so many niggas that joking. <laughs> Go home with a black eye so bad, I don't want to come off that school bus at that stop so many times. Sure. <laughs> Nigga go all the way back to school. <laughs> 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 Nigga take that trip all the way back to school. <laughs> <laughs> right by the bus driver. <laughs> Nigga, right, right. No nigga dead serious on that ass, boy. Nigga be, nigga be calling the whole gang at the bus stop. Nigga, I'm finna whoop this nigga ass when I get on this bus. Nigga. I had went to, um, when I was in school, I had went to the little shit, the little CP shit. Off the trail? Well, I went to the oh. one on the east side. Oh, okay. So, when I went, bro, I got in like six, five, five, six seven fights on the east side, bro. Just because. They culture clashing with the West Side culture. Like, them niggas over there, they joke a lot. And, like, yeah. they be doing, like, little funny shit. Like, <laughs> niggas be trying to, like, hit niggas in the nuts and shit. And we weren't with it. Like, the whole West Side, we weren't with the shit. That was my first fight. That was my first fight in CEP. Nigga told me some nuts, check. <laughs> Tried to hit a nigga in the nuts. I beat the shit out of this little Spanish dude. But I'm like, bro, don't play with me, bro. <laughs> Talking about some nut check. <laughs> See, when, when the cultures, when the cultures collide, bro, that shit be crazy. Uh-huh. Like niggas. Oh, niggas oh, oh cool. nut check. They think it's the shit you got no call. Yeah, hit you in the oh, nuts oh, and shit. Oh, oh. So, bro, I'm walking in, I'm walking in line one day. They used to do that shit. In so, school. bro, just walk by and just go like this, like nut check, try to hit me in my nuts. Beat the man. They like, hey, man, man, the West Side dudes, they don't even like. Cracking, no. Yeah, yeah, we don't crack. <laughs> Too black. That's what make you think you finna try to hit me in my nest and we not gonna fight. I'm saying the West. Yeah, West. West. What? What? West. West. That's my nose. Bro, Rosemont, Nermo, where you from? Hmm? What, like, West Carver City. Shores, Richmond Heights? All from Mercy. Oh, oh you Mercy. from Mercy? Yeah. Cause I'm not nah, city. Nah, nah. I'm, di- I'm from a different side of the bridge. I'm from yeah. the West, not the bridge. Oh, you ain't from the bridge? All right. And then say, I'm from Mercy, boy. The no, O. Oh, but you be everywhere, right? Yeah, I be everywhere. Yeah, I could tell you, like, I don't, whatever hood, nigga. Hey, I go, I don't want to go anywhere about the bill. I know it's going to fuck with me. You ain't worried about school? And I mind my business. You know what I'm saying? Like, what y'all was just friendly? Y'all just with comedy or it was personal? Hmm? You and Spook? That it was comedy? Yeah, I was just doing it. Yeah, that was just comedy. They was just That's going right. in. Because, you know, Spook. He just be cracking on random people. Yeah, he'll do it. And he do people. prank he calls. Do but you so went much. first. Yeah. Yeah. Because <clears throat> nobody didn't do it. I had to be the first person to do it. To do it to spook? Yeah. And I ain't see yours. Where you, where you post yours at? On, on his page. page. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's so funny. Because he go in a little bit. He go in a little funny. bit. He said Spook went came ASAP. Yeah, for a whole he hour. said he did came. That bit quick as fuck. <laughs> <laughs> like, like, five five minutes, tagging him. Like five minutes, did, did that bit. You didn't reply. That go with huh? the, that go with, that go with the following no, too, bro. Yeah. Like you can't, you can't. Some people like, <laughs> yeah, you like can't. That, what you call the shit? Um, like that Drake and Meek shit. Meek, wrap his ass off. Drake is a, a world, a world mm. artist. Like global. If, even if he would have came out with some whack shit, his <laughs> yeah, people would have pushed him up yeah. to the shit would have looked like it was good. So but like he didn't come out with no whack shit though. No, nah, no, nah, nah, hell no. Nah. Yeah, I'm yeah, just saying, can't. like when your fan base like that, that's kind of like when you go into war. You he almost, be, you he almost, be ready. he almost killed me career if he ain't go to jail, boy. That was, boy, that Drake went hard, boy. Drake tried to take that boy out. That boy had to hit him up. That boy had to hit him up. I probably, Drake, Drake said Nicky saved him when uh, Nicky took him on the uh, tour. <laughs> uh, nigga. So with the comedy jump, so you, so you, you feel like you, you won or you feel like you lost? Oh no, bro. Are you are you going are you going to come back? I might I might do another one. Yeah, you I gotta do another one, bro. You gotta do another one. Yeah, yeah. Cause that's, that's your thing. You gotta keep doing. It. You can't stay on the neck, bro. 
He already Spook, said Spook bro. one right now. He already a said whole it. Said, hour long. He already we said it. Two minute clip. <laughs> it's on YouTube. Man. No, no, you do stand up. Nah, yeah, you nah. don't do stand up. <laughs> yeah, no, nah, I just do it on Instagram. What's the difference? Huh? You scared to do it in front of people? Nah, I don't know about that, bro. I don't go places and shit like that. I be in the house. Mm-hmm. Oh, shit man. like that. Too much. You ever perform somewhere? Huh? You nah. perform somewhere before? Nah. He oh, can't okay. be shooting up people and just be out there <laughs> out in the open, boy. Niggas. One shot. <laughs> Niggas be, niggas be prowling, boy. You sure? Oh, you got Twitter fingers. You, know, you got them Twitter fingers. You got to stand in the house, boy. He can't be on the Twitter <laughs> fingers and be out like that, boy. Them boys be here. This shit is serious on the west side. Niggas, niggas is not playing. Niggas is spinning and spinning again. <laughs> niggas is spinning their fingers, really playing, boy. Though. <laughs> but he can't have them Twitter fingers and be like, Nah, boy, you gotta have something in that fanny pack. You got something in the fanny pack. You can't nah. have no bubble gum in there. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't got nothing in the fanny pack. Oh, you don't got nothing in the fanny pack. You tripping? This <laughs> <laughs> with a fanny pack or something in that bitch. The little deuce, deuce. It's a little four five. That's the nigga, fashion thing. Nigga, <laughs> nigga, <laughs> nigga ain't got no bubble gum in no. <laughs> 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 That nigga got a bubble gum and some tobacco. That nigga yeah, got some blunts in there. Damn, T Black. What you got in the fanny pack, Man, dog? I got all my shit in here, my belongings. <laughs> <laughs> that that like I, got my two, I got my toothpaste, yeah. little deodorant. That <laughs> 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 shit to get me through the day. Oh, got my belongings in here. <laughs> got Ain't my phone. Wrong with that. <laughs> <laughs> make sure that's make sure make sure that shit ain't look, gonna get lost. Hey, you gotta be man. I'm glad I'm glad y'all, I'm glad y'all was on some play play junk. Cause man, Spook what? Spook be having the two twins in the back seat. <laughs> can't, be, can't be playing with the fanny pack with the two with the phone in her. This man riding around with the twins in the back seat. He whooping them. <laughs> He turned on the behave. <laughs> Can't be playing like that, man. You, you rap, man. We gotta hear some of your music, man. You got some of his music. Which one? Golds? Yeah, you can play that one. You got bars. T Black Gold. Or punchlines. Got all that. Punchlines the bars. Send it to me. Bars and and I ain't line. got it. Yeah, he talking crazy. Bars and punchlines. Man, you already told me ain't nothing in the fanny pack. I ain't got nothing in there, bro. He ain't got nothing in the fanny pack. <laughs> I ain't even scared. I need some balls and punch line. They got aggressive. Balls and punch line. I ain't spooked. I ain't I ain't spooked. I ain't even make no I ain't even make no diss. Okay. What else? That man set you up. That man over there set you up. I ain't know nothing about the little diss track or nothing. I need to be better prepared, yeah. man. Why man, you didn't send me a text and be like, he the one, man. He man, got a you song, did. bro. This shit could probably do something, man. He, he this got nigga a different market, up. man. He didn't even let me know you and Spook were shooting at each other. I would have had a better, I would have been ready for yeah, it. I was going to try to get Spook to call in. Actually, pull up. Just had him man, round right. two. Mm-hmm. Round two go in. Who, Spook? Yeah. I can hit Spook up right now, man. See if Spook on it. You roll with him? Yeah. <laughs> I just got to keep asking, man. <laughs> he act like you ain't roll with him. <laughs> uh, yeah, you roll with Bree. Bree wouldn't have picked him up. <laughs> Bree ass ran up his sleeve, man. Imagine with the man with his fanny pack. Goddamn spook. But you shot first, though. You started. I said you started. You started it. I had to. But you said somebody had to. Yeah. <laughs> Dang, T Black. Dang. I went on your page. Little bro got off first. Oh, yeah, he got off first. You ain't wrong. Sometimes, well, 100% of the time, you got to get off first. If, yeah. If, if you want to if you wanna, stay, if you want to stay out here. <laughs> you got to get, get off first. For real. That was my theory when I was a jit. I was I was a yeah, little yeah. nigga, so I was like, "Fuck it, if I get off first, that's all they gonna remember." Mm-hmm. 
So when niggas, big niggas be bothering me, I just get off. Fuck it. I'm just get off. The only thing nigga gonna remember is me getting off on your ass. That mentality, that mentality will get you, get you far. Cause boy, listen. But sometimes, but see, sometimes I got off and I just was hitting them in the right spot. Like I would hit that bitch in they nose. It's over with. I think he finna get up. <laughs> they getting up with tears in his eyes. Like you hit that bitch on that bottom of that chin. Nigga trying to rush you. Hit that nigga with that chin. Shit, that's how I know I had some hands then. I hit a couple of them niggas. Them niggas went to their knees first before they grabbed me. I was like, oh yeah, I got your ass. <laughs> nigga don't grab me so weak. <laughs> I have nigga call time out one time. What the fuck What's been going out? on this week, man? Shit. Election coming up. Y'all make sure y'all go vote, man. November 2nd. Hmm? What's up? The cologne. <laughs> oh, yeah, my dog got some cologne. Oh, yeah. We said we live still? Oh, we still live. Got some cologne. I bet smell like that. That's yours. That be hard too. Yo, this is my cologne. Uh, Kari. The joint website KariSmells dot com. K H A R I S M E L L S dot com. Um, I got a perfume and a cologne. Um, Hello, CBD been products out. as well. Um, the perfume and cologne been out a year and a half. That bitch doing good. I got a couple of loyal. Like loyal customers that, that fuck with me like, has been fucking with me for a year, so and I just dropped the, the CBD on uh, CBD line. Shit going up. You what, gotta the have vape? other avenues. The vape man. pens? No, nah, it's a pain cream and a. Um, oh okay. And it's a bath bomb for the ladies. Got tincture too. Uh, CBD tincture for people with anxiety and stress and shit. Where are we in right now? Some people need it. Some people don't want to smoke, but some people be needing some shit to get some shit off their mind. You send it up on the music? Yeah. Yeah, Damn that Tony Black. What's go ahead, Tony. Bring it in. The track. Huh? Introduce your song. <laughs> that boy aggressive. Oh, T Black huh? goes. Huh? T Black goes. That T Black man goes. What you mean you want my honey bun? I ain't got no goals in my mouth, but I'm from Florida. I just took my teeth off, send a kid across the border. If you run up on me, put your ass on law and order. Okay, say this bitch gon' strike like some thunder. I ain't got no goals in my mouth, but I'm from Florida. I just took my teeth off, send a kid across the border. Run up if you want, put your ass on law and order. Okay, say this bitch gon' strike like some thunder. All partners and she took off her panty. Then I know I'm wet. I like to cut the set. Cut it off like that. <laughs> That's the end of the song. All, that, yeah. that dog got all the jokes. <laughs> he got all the jokes. That. He went the bullshit. He just stopped. See, that his head nine, his head nine. I was nine. You were nine. You were nine. I was nine. Yeah. I, was, I like the beat. Yeah, I like the whole. Nice. Nice. He said yeah, he, he ain't got going. no goals, but he from Florida. Or, but you just stopped. Why you just stopped like that? Huh? Why you just stopped it? That's all I had. That's all I wrote. <laughs> it don't matter though, that bitch now. 
<laughs> hey, so that was it. That I'm saying you should have brought the hook back. Something. You just stopped in the verse. <laughs> and he said, that's it. Once you get, how many balls that was? No, no but it was just freestyle. <laughs> I, don't, I don't be writing. I don't be writing. I just be going. How many you know, balls you thought that was? I don't even know. I thought. I how don't many balls you think that was? That was about that was about a sixteen. That was a sixteen. Yeah. I guess no, it was it was about, about it was about it was a verse. It was a hook, a verse, and then a hook, hook again, and then, and then you did another verse, two verses. Ah, hell no. Oh, so it was like it was <laughs> like. Hell no, he went too. He gave you too much credit. I think <laughs> it was like a sixteen. Like a hook, a half hook, verse. Yeah, that was you did right. A hook, a verse, three hook. Well. Know what time it is, man. <laughs> the shit got potential. I say keep going. Man, you man. got three hook in the verse. Doing you your Mike Tyson stupid. shit. Man, I ain't got. I ain't got to make my songs that long, bro. <laughs> How long it took you? That to nigga make on that? the raw way oh, shit. That long nigga said. That, that nigga said I ain't got to make my song that long. Hours. Oh, hours. Yeah, cause that nigga on the that raw that way. Way. How long that was? Thirty minutes? Thirty seconds? I mean. About one. About one thirty. Yeah, that's a raw way song. See, Yo, that's how that shit. That's hours. how that shit for the yeah, transition yeah, too, man. man was, that's how music transition too man, short. I'm so tired, of y'all giving us with these one verses. I swear, I'll be ready to break my radio. <laughs> yeah, Rod, what is song? Be like two minutes. Nigga, give a verse. Nigga, give a verse. It's crazy. Oh, it's crazy. Oh, Niggas used to give three verses, verse, and that's it. I'll be like, you pussy nigga. I'm gonna start making my songs longer, but that shit be out of. Nah, nah, don't make it longer because it ain't. It ain't. It ain't. Don't make it longer, cause then it ain't gonna be worth it. It's marketable too, because Yo. if you think about it, just a nigga IG got a song songs. four minutes and thirty seconds, then it's a nigga with two <laughs> a song with two minute two minutes and fifteen seconds. That means I can listen to two of this nigga songs with one of this song. So that's two screams for for that one. So the shorter the song, that nigga that nigga Rod right Wade did that, bro. That was that was marketing, bro. Just imagine you listen to that, cause you gonna bring it back. Uh man, play that bitch again. It's too short. That bitch hard, but play it again. That's a screen, screen, screen. That shit, that shit marketing, bro. Yeah, yeah. That shit genius, bro. That shit so hard, run that shit back. For real, yeah, run that bitch back. That shit, just, when it's a good song, it's aggravating. It's like, <laughs> motherfucker, you only gave me one bar. For real. <laughs> and they only gave me one verse. Like, nigga, I want to hear that shit. <laughs> But now yeah. you gotta do what you say. You gotta, you gotta keep, bring that bitch back. You gotta keep bringing that bitch back here in that same verse. For real. I don't know what you were gonna say in the second verse. <laughs> For real. But I ain't gonna lie, bro. Some, some, um, some shit like nigga be in the studio there, drop some shit. Then nigga be like, bro, you you want to put a second verse on this bitch? Nigga be like, well, I don't know, boy. That nah, first nah, shit. Nah, you can't. Nah, this generation right away fucked it up. You can't. No more second verses. You can't do it. Unless what is the second unless verse? It's a feature. Unless it's a feature. You can't do it no more. <laughs> they, he don't fuck the game, bro. Bill don't even want to hear the second yeah, verse. Bill don't want to hear the Bill second verse. Bill like, bring that first one back, bro, what he said. Bro, after, just didn't even need to get but after, after, Yo, a while, after a while, after a while, they just going to be making IG clips, 60 seconds. G shit. The nigga just hear your whole song in the IG clip. <laughs> <laughs> For real. Because this shit just getting crazy. I'm like, man, that's why I said, man, I'm, I'm, I'm to the slow jam. They're going to get me... Even though the verse yeah, is gonna yeah, be seven, the same, seven minutes, bro. At least the verse is gonna be the same verse, but at least I'm, I'm at least I can ride to it. Nigga, oh, nigga, you have some long you be, ass you be song. trying to ride to a, to the new way song. That shit gonna be over soon as you turn it on. Yeah. So you get one minute, you be like, man, the whole a whole project be down to thirty exactly. minutes. Like, nigga Not even thirty nigga. minutes. A nigga can listen to a nigga whole mixtape in like yeah. an hour, like. Nigga, Listen to your old mixtape. Bro, I realize that when I be flying, bro. Like I, I've put on a nigga's uh, project and like, all right, when this bitch over, we should be the <laughs> that bitch be over. I be like, damn, damn. man. I yeah. listen to four more projects. I ain't really, I ain't really realize that to take made that scar forever. I was like, damn, I listen to that song two. I listened to the whole CD two times. I just went to town. Should be like that, bro. <laughs> <For> <laughs> real. Now I looked at the long, how long the, the the songs is. I'm like, oh, that's why. These so shit, these shit right ain't though. even two minutes. Yeah. Huh? I said he did that that project right too. Oh, that's called forever. Yeah, that bit that bit hard, oh, but it's just like I said, a lot of them songs I be wanting like a second verse. 
It's just curiosity. Like, what you want to say on the second verse? You get what I'm saying? Like, anybody <laughs> good on the first verse? Like, what you got to say on the second? Like, that's that's the thing that artists don't know. Like, y'all cheating the fans. Like, okay, everybody going to ride on the first, on that first 16. What you going to say on the next one, though? You get what I'm saying? So, with the artists, y'all get a, a, a you know what I'm talking about? Y'all cheating. Like, all right, I can come. Everybody go hard at first 16. What you going to say on the next one? Or the next one? Nobody got. It's always See, more bro, to the story. My 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 second my second verses on on my project on this on this album shit. I'ma have to I'ma have to give them have to give them like the time on the songs too because like I understand what you're saying, but like when you're doing songs that you just finna put out and like give people for free, yeah, that yeah. shit be like nah, 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 you be nah, like nah. let me give somebody some yeah, shit yeah, yeah. some hard shit then. No, nah, no, nah, don't follow me. I'm, I'm no, no, I'm just that saying shit. that go. Everybody say that. Nah, a lot nah, of people say that. DJ, nah, because the era, I, like, to get your shit marketed, yeah, just do the raw wave shit. Because niggas' attention span is short. Oh like, yeah, hell yeah. Man, like, don't even do no long, um, intros no more. Like that, all that letting the beat play. No, just come on that bitch spitting. Because niggas' I think attention span is shorter that. than the bitch. That's niggas what I'm doing. That That's what I'm doing on my project now. Nah, yeah, I, I got, I got like six. Six or seven yeah, skits on my shit. Like, master, uh, like skits on the album. Yeah. Like Master P used to do them on his, Lil Wayne. Like, hey, uh, can I talk to P? Oh, yeah. yeah the, like, uh, shit. You got to like do that like, when you popping. Because, like, niggas don't want to hear that shit. Like, you got to come on that bitch spin. All real. To get a bitch's see, attention. album got, like, four yeah, five he got skits a, on it. Yeah, that's why ain't nobody listening to y'all right now. Shit. Nobody ain't listening to y'all. But that's T.I., up and coming artists, listen to me. Time you let the beat come out, you not you not T.I. You not a person that I'm gonna sit and listen and wait. Like, I'm gonna listen to that beat, boom, boom, boom. And then if I don't hear no bars, yeah, especially if I'm on YouTube, bitch, I'm already looking at other videos. Bro. See, that's, <laughs> why you that's why. <laughs> Once I hit play on your shit, I'm already looking at other. I already got a thought, like, I want to hear his shit. You get what I'm saying? I already got an idea of who I want to listen to. So if you take too long, I'm going to hit that bitch. That's why, that's why, that's why the lanes, the lanes is important, bro. Like, it's different, it's different markets and lanes for different artists. That's why that shit's so important. You got, you got your little babies. Mm -hmm. Then you got your Coles. A nigga going to listen to Cole. Cole, listen, Cole fans, anybody who listen to that kind of music, they going to listen to... The goddamn everything triangles in the back of the beat. Yeah. Like these niggas really like niggas who really but, tune but in see, to that know, kind J, of music. J. Cole got an artist like those real hip hop heads. Yeah, I'm saying like that yeah. lane, that lane. So anybody in that lane, them them kind of fans, that's what they listen to. Even if you got ten followers or ten million followers, they gonna listen to you how they listen to J. Cole because they trying to listen to, they trying to consciously connect you, connect yeah, with yeah. you with the music. That's a that's a lane though. And then you got the other lane, which don't got no attention. That's yeah, we got man, no we want spirit. we want the bar. As soon as that bitch boom boom <laughs> spit, no hook, bitch. We don't want no hook. Fuck a hook. <laughs> yeah, now I need a hook. <laughs> Just a hook need to add up to what you're saying for me. But I don't know, man. I like just like I listen to hip hop and then I study hip hop for marketing. Mm -hmm. So uh, I'm I'm in two different. I be in two different modes. Like far as like marketing your music right now, just for the attention span, unless like you said, you already got your gender crowd that you finna you attack. Yeah. Then you know how to promote your music. Right. But so, if you just trying to get no. people attention fast, just just get a dope beat and don't even play with it off rip. Because like even if you give it to a DJ, any DJ will, will tell you like they. The two seconds mean the most, just like a movie. The first five minutes mean the most. Is if I'm gonna sit here and listen to this shit, or I'm gonna click to the next movie. You get what I'm saying? So you gotta understand what most people look at your mu your music on is YouTube. You get what I'm saying? So it's like, True. like I said, so many other people on that bitch. When I pull up your shit, so many other people shit that I'm like already. Like I'm already excited to go to somebody else shit. So it's like if you on that bitch steady. Talking and slow dragging. If I'm not already a fan of you, I I done left. Oh yeah. I done left already. Yes. I'm 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 on to this dude. Like, you 
You feel what I'm saying? Oh, what the baby it's talking that, about? You know, yeah, the baby yeah, beefing yeah. with this dude that, <laughs> you know, Kendrick yeah. Jamal said something about, you know, right. Troy, Lane, Troy Lane's done said something about making. It's so much. So it's like right now you just got to be able to just hit mm -hmm. a nigga in the mouth and keep it going. You got to get off first. Yeah, you got to get yeah. off first like what you told him, right? Knock a nigga out. Huh? Yo, one stop. So we got another song with... Man, we can't go no more to his songs, man. I can't tolerate that shit. What you mean, man? What you trying to say? <laughs> that shit, there, man. You just dropping them songs, man. We got to hear some music, man. That shit, that shit, there, man. You got to finish your balls, man. You got to finish that shit out, man. Nigga ain't on that shit, man. This dude, we want to do radio, man. Nigga ain't on that shit, though, man. <laughs> nigga, we here with this platform for real artists, man. Nigga, that really serious about this shit. You playing. <laughs> Man, we I don't got you. we don't I got nothing you. with pressure, man. I, I, so I, shit, you would complete I, I, the whole song, stop in the middle of the damn verse. <laughs> shit, <you're> aggravating. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it was just stop in the middle of the verse, like fuck you. <laughs> I got I got to listen to this shit. <laughs> Bro, I didn't. I, I <laughs> when I heard the song, I heard it on Spook's page, right? Oh, Spook, Spook paid it. He on live went through the, the man. I said, "Damn, that shit kind of hard though." You got another song that's oh full. Hmm? You got another song that's done. He was like, hey, "Man, all my songs be short, but that's just how." Oh, oh, raw way. You raw way the shit. About the way I rap, about. Mm -hmm. You don't want to hear that shit. I'm pretty. It, 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 <laughs> you can't hear that shit. I can't. Oh, you help him with the structure, man. I don't you want understand yeah. the, the, the music, the instrument, like when you come in, the hook, the verse and all that, and you hear the shit and you just go. Nah, nah, I understand it. He just do that just to be different, right? He got a different market, man. But he cracked what jokes you know with it, so it's going to yeah. make a person go to his music. <sighs> That's a lot of people's gear. Like that dude, Demario, y'all heard of him? The little mm -hmm. silent rapper or some shit like that. Bro, the nigga spit <laughs> on Spook <laughs> on his live. <laughs> you see that? You coming from that nigga? Like man, all that, oh, nah, that wasn't shit. him. That nigga said, <laughs> "Oh, he spit." Literally, Spook spit. was live together on on live. Oh, I saw that. I know. You seen know. that? Yeah, all yeah, right. Now. We got something, yeah. Andrew. What, 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 what else you got? Yo, that was she on. My dog, hell, man, T, Tony Black, man, T Black, man. Man, we just got to stay on the jokes, man. What jokes, who you who you shooting at, man? How many people you on shot at? <clears throat> like three people. Who? Only did, I did Spook, and I uh, I cracked on Ghana. Ghana, who that is? You don't know that rapper Ghana? That Bill Young Thug and all that. <laughs> gunner, gunner. Oh, gunner, gunner. Oh, yeah. oh. I ain't oh. see that. <laughs> oh, you I shooting, shooting. I didn't see that. <laughs> I ain't see that. <laughs> I think you shooting I, that local. I got no, uh, Papa No Randy, too. Who? Papa, Papa No Randy? Randy? Oh, oh, um, you know him? Dog. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That he from dog. here? Nah, he nah. from Broward. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm about, I'm about to have him do a comedy show. <laughs> he ain't shoot back. Man, I know Randy shot back. Oh, Randy, like. Oh, no. He like you gotta get your got your get get your fan base up. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, all right. Dang. Man, I wanna do it. I mean, we need to do a comedy show battle type shit where y'all just battle each other, just crying joke. You scared to do that? Hmm? Well y'all just do stand up comedy, just battling each other face to face. Like battle rap. Like battle rap. Yeah. Yeah, no. Know about that shit. It ain't through the it ain't through the telephone. It's like face to face, nigga, nigga cracking jokes like old school. Like nigga, I get pumping over Randy, you, <laughs> Spoo. Y'all just battle like y'all just go at it. Like nigga, look at what you got on, nigga, <laughs> and all that shit. All the shit you would say over the over the Instagram, yeah, you saying yeah. face to face. That shit would be dope. Ain't nobody did that. Oh, that my shit, shit not. Crazy. Yeah, that shit gonna be crazy. That shit'll be dope, man. You nigga gonna come out with a woodwork with jokes, man. You got, man. I know Randy gonna ride some shit. Probably know Randy gonna ride some shit. I don't see him. You need to go around the city and ride on people like Pompano or Randy. You ain't did that yet. No, I think about doing. That'll be dope. 
Came me riding around with that pen, fender back with nothing in it, though. Like, <laughs> niggas no, niggas shit like shooting like for real. <laughs> West Orlando, <laughs> niggas <laughs> shooting for real. Like, you gonna be <laughs> pulling up, cracking jokes, boy. These niggas can't take no joke, boy. <laughs> <laughs> These niggas can't take a joke, boy. These niggas, you right, boy. These niggas gonna wanna shoot something, man. You gotta have a little scooter that's real fast. You gotta have that bit upgraded. Like, you gotta put a chip in that bit. <laughs> And then you gotta have that. Then you gotta have like a four five in that bit, <laughs> like a little little four five. Nah, I'm, I'm about to get Snoop. Mm-hmm. You about to do what? I'm about to get me a candy food. I just turned twenty one. I was waiting to. Oh, uh, this you right here. Right like to have my shit. <laughs> That nigga putting clips on top of clips on your ass. <laughs> that nigga had he clips. He was taking pictures in front of Listen, the car. Listen, that nigga was. <laughs> the neighbor's car. He oh, said you spread it with $18. Car, <laughs> <laughs> that nigga rolled your ass. I seen that shit. I'm like, damn. I ain't know what he was talking about. You ain't even saying the post. You ain't even saying the post like he was going at the <laughs> This nigga. That's what he was talking about. Man, oh, oh, oh. I'm so off guard on this interview, man. I thought you were come up here and spit some bars, man. We got pressure up here, man. This the bar king, man. You came up here and did been 15 and a half bars. You got the bar king, man. That's like an insult, man. I, I, do, I thought you had somebody that had. That's my bad, though. I can't even blame you. Hey, you going to see? Wait, wait. You gonna see. I thought you had bars, man. Just like like last week. I can make longer songs, but I just don't like that shit. Be aggravating. Bro. But that's what I'm saying. I thought you came up. I thought he had somebody that, when you see pressure, and then anybody else, you gonna just automatic think like, oh, this nigga gonna come with some bars. <laughs> you gotta come with some bars, man. You came with a few punchline, nice little hook, and then you just came with like two more punchline, then stop. So don't want no bars. You might as well listen to what I was saying. Uh oh. <laughs> nah, they was they was alright, but man, we got pressure up here. Man. You ain't heard his music. You freestyle. Oh, yeah, you he said you freestyle them music. songs, right? You What's freestyle up? them songs. <laughs> yeah, I freestyle them songs. He said oh, no so pad, you no pen. Instrumental? You got pressure, pressure. You freestyle. What you do, man? This man said he got bars for days, man. This man just said, nigga, you you listen? Did you hear what I was saying? I, to be honest, I ain't listen, man. That shit, I ain't listen, bro. I listen to the hook. <laughs> a lot of that shit lost me when you cut off. I thought you were gonna come with some bars, bars. I old. You know what bars, bars is? What's bars, bars? Let me spit, spit two then. Some bars, <laughs> yes. bars. It, it's not easy for me to freestyle. Not easy. Not easy, man. I started. That man said it like. Start over. Start Verse. over. Yeah, it ain't need verses. Like, two I balls. I could come with some dynamite. Yeah. Two balls, man. You tripping? I don't even rap. I come out with. A, I come out the gate with some hard shit. And then my brain gonna shut down. Like kind of like what you did on the second verse. Chris, <laughs> 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 yo, yo, man. You shouldn't call it now. Nigga, they care when I call, yeah. Star, for real. I'm fighting for this shit just like you. For real. Hey. Fighting for your love on the battlefield. Aiming for the kill, get them out of here. Interference, all in communication. Damn. In one ear, then it's out the other ear. 
Social media have you living for another motherfucker. The views of another motherfucker. That's propaganda, but you look over things, especially when you love one another. I'm fighting for us, you ran it, we bust and fall. Love must be in the air, I smell it all. And it seems like roses and peaches, but it's more like cactus and thorns. And life don't throw smoking mirrors, and that's when illusions are born. And right when you catch them in the lap, that's when the truth gon' form. I'm a camo on, try to bend in, push my words aside like an indent. I brought flowers to you to know my intent. I know you got the text message I've been sent. Tend to save us, even though society is trying to enslave us. On the battlefield of love, I ask the man the ball, strengthen the love, cause that's what really made us. Love ain't blind, it's reality. No. 2020 vision highs after me. Real. But I'm a real soldier, won't rattle me. Tension in the ad, you can cut it if you want it. Love a test game, gotta study my opponent. Ten steps ahead, now I'm back to the future. Countless gunfights, look back when I shoot the light. Wow. Shit get real in a second. Standing in the field with my weapon. Shots got five wheels text. But through the combat, you a blessing. It ain't real love, it ain't pain involved. But sunny days mean more when it's raining. Friends and enemies got the same faces Words cut deeper than knives These emotions you can't see with your eyes Attach with your hands, this language for the soul Through the battlefield when intentions get exposed uh, I intend to save us Even though society is trying to enslave us On the battlefield of love I ask the man the ball to strengthen the love Cause that's what really made us Do what we want to do. What, what the name of that? Battlefield, your love. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Relationship. Yeah, the relationship. Yeah. That's out. Man. Dog like it ain't out yet. Dog like he got balls like that too, man. I'm waiting. Dog like we gonna get him in the studio. Dog like I got balls too, man. Okay. Oh, that on release. Uh, oh, alright, man. We got some unreleased on Do What You Want to Do Radio, man. <laughs> dog, my dog over here. He say he got balls like that too, man. Pressure you sleeping. You got balls it's like that. Like that. It's something like that. Something like that. Something and like not like here, though. You have to really go through some shit to make balls like that. <laughs> <laughs> you feel me? That's the real shit. I ain't never heard nobody make a song like that. That's hey, that's real. He's keeping a buck. You know, hey, smooth, man. Hey. <laughs> Hey man, I feel you, man. He set you up, man. I thought that I, I oh. don't know why he put you on the on the on the panel with with, with pressure. I'm thinking you coming with some bars, man. I will, that's why I was like, if I, I don't know, yeah. we should have had you here with somebody else. Having these meetings again. Man. Yeah, man, cause he just bringing people. This shit lopsided like a motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> Ain't nobody hit me back with the text. Yeah, like, hold on, let's do something. You know what I'm saying, but hey, hey man, I just gave, I gave him the radio. benefit of the doubt. I'm like, he bringing black, black gotta be dope. Look, hey, he got the pressure, man. T Black, T Black, T man. Dog. But he, T Black be more on the comedy now. You got market, jokes though. If y'all you got, he got them balls I'm on saying. them jokes though. He in a different market. He in a different market. You'll see. 
gotta watch this guy, man. He be trying to creep in niggas' pockets, man. He be trying to boost you up. To get I sit you down with artists. I show them this shit. I see? don't hide nothing. They see everything. See how he picked you up? He I knew put, you had I on put the them on, I, I He didn't tell you. <laughs> he didn't tell you to take it. I showed him how to get paid. He didn't tell you to take it off. For their streams on And then he Instagram. let you come in here and sit down on, on the couch. Facebook. Then he said something about your you fanny pack. You know you get paid for your views on Instagram and Facebook? Oh, Charles. Oh, wow. He wait till they say action. Then he like, hey, ain't that a fanny pack? Like, nigga, I drove all the way over here with you in the car. You didn't ask me that when I got in the car. That nigga, that nigga, <laughs> who brought it up? I ain't bring it up. You brought it up. I say fanny pack, though. <laughs> who, brought, who said it? He said it. I, I, I who it said it? Else. I think I called it a pouch. Yeah, he I said did. fanny pack? It, what it's called? I was born in the 80s, man. We called them pouches. Pouches. That's a pouch. I don't know a fanny pack. I don't man, know what that pack. is. That's what we call them. That's nah, a fanny pack. That's a 90s, 2000 thing. I don't know. Hey, pressure, what this is? It's a a fanny pack or a pouch? I'd be like I a waist the pouch. <laughs> the fanny pack. I thought the fanny pack was like the purse one. It ain't no, no, it's not a sports bag. Definitely not. Yeah, that. Nah. No, the purse one. I say whatever I just said it was. Uh, um, oh, a pouch. pouch. Yeah. The purse one they call the messenger bags. Oh, the messenger bags. Right. That's the, the yeah. That's the professional name. Message pack. That what's that? Message pack. Yeah, nah, nah, nigga. It's a fanny pack, nigga. Oh, like that? What the fuck? <laughs> he stuck on that fanny pack. I ain't even mad. I don't know. Hell no, nigga. This ain't no <laughs> message bag, nigga. This is a fanny pack. What's the difference? <laughs> that nigga got a fanny pack. You like the fanny pack? What's the difference? Hmm? The fanny pack from the message bag. Radio. But a message. Okay. I don't Martin. know what the fuck a message is bad. Press was the first one oh, told me about the message of bad. <laughs> nah, he was the first one to ever. I never heard message of bad in my life. That's that's what that's that millionaire talk. That's that millionaire talk. That's millionaire talk. And I got on cargo shorts, man. I don't know about that talk, man. <laughs> I got on some shit, but you know, <laughs> he. he <laughs> How much them messenger bags cost? Damn. That's why I'm no, a dog screen. That's why you scream. Like, nigga, I ain't got no messenger bag. You <laughs> take out on a fanny pack. This shit cost $20. <laughs> How much the fanny pack cost? No. What oh, you got from Didi? Huh? My sister had bought this bit from me. I don't know. Uh, 70, 100 bucks. All right. My dog got 100. I could probably could afford that. I fuck with that. But I ain't gonna wear that shit though. We ain't even wear that shit around our neck. We used to wear that shit around our waist. Like, nigga, nigga ain't, I ain't wearing no shit. That, that bitch a Uzi. Yes, it is, but it's how we wear it now. But I ain't wearing that shit around my waist. Uh-huh. No I wear it, especially when I go to theme parties. Nah, well, we legit. Right you used to wear that bitch. Nigga, nigga, nigga just had that bitch around your waist. Had your phones and your little. To be honest with you, when we wear them bitches, we be still. Nigga going, that nigga bit. going right and, and fucking win this and load up that little fanny pack <laughs> shit. Whatever you want to call that bitch. <laughs> or put a little start on over overall start in. That bitch got a fanny pack on there too. Put that bitch in there. Huh? Fanny that nigga pack. got deodorant and toothbrush and <laughs> nigga got a little personal <laughs> mouthwash in that bitch. <laughs> They got a sandwich in that bitch for later. They <laughs> <laughs> said, I got my personal shit in here. <laughs> Let's see, man. Pressure. When the project dropping? I'm working, I'm working huh? right now about to drop. Oh, shit. Drop man, pressure, they need you with a mic. They can't hear you. I got a single that I'm dropping on next month. What single? Uh-oh. Yeah, you talking about as far as like, the storyline of the other of the track, I give you the hook. Um, <laughs> still on the battle on ball for ball. You can't nah, keep repaying hey, people who show you rap, that man. you cover. Look around, nigga. Just see, nigga. I don't think Hold you can rap. Look, he want to battle me. Hold on, man. He want to battle me, man. He sleep on and tear your ass up, man. You over here want to battle me? Uh oh. Let's go. 
Now go ahead and finish So your, the true colors is uh you can't get on your ass later. People show you their true colors. <laughs> so basically is if a motherfucker show you that the real, the, real, the real person they is, you can't go back and say I'm gonna take all that off and review them as when they gave you the real. So basically I'm like the song is stop. And then motherfuckers back then who already done burnt the bridge. Oh yeah, that'd be hard. That's what that's cuz when you that shit caused more problems than the bridge really fall. Then that bitch, both of y'all fall in that bitch. Yeah, so, I feel that. And I shot the video too with um, Ghost. We shot that bitch like two, three weeks ago. You talking about directed by Ghost? Yeah, directed by okay. Ghost. We shot that bitch like two or three weeks ago. So I got the video shot. We about mm -hmm. to drop. We about to drop that bitch with Apple Music. So the video and the single gonna play on Apple Music together. That's what. Yeah, we, you ain't playing right now. I like I like that concept. That concept is with the corona, everybody going through them, them colors. Right now, everybody with them fucking colors. Bitch been in the house too long. <laughs> <laughs> Bitch is showing colors on their damn self. Yeah, they don't even know who they is. <laughs> they don't been in the house so long. <laughs> they don't even like who they is no more. <laughs> we still alive? Yeah, we mm -hmm. live. This nigga over here wanna battle me, man. You wanna I battle? don't wanna battle you, bad. You, you wanna, wanna battle, battle me, out? Bad. Nah, I just ask you, I ain't a rapper. I promote rap. I don't know rap, but I, man. The first two balls, I'm going to eat your ass. So I'm going to tell you that now. <laughs> can't rap, then. Don't even do it. Drop the beat, man. Drop the beat. <laughs> man, you Drop did it. Drop the beat. He going to tell me not to do something that he don't did. Drop the beat. Because I've been doing it for a long time. <laughs> oh, shit. Okay. <laughs> All right, I got a pressure going to take my fade then. <laughs> Drop the beat. You ready? Now, why you got to take your place? This is then you. Oh man, this man <laughs> amp about to get on me, man. <laughs> <laughs> this nigga amp. <laughs> man, pray gotta take that fair. I don't rap. I'm gonna, I'm gonna give you two five bars and I'm gonna stop. You want that? Cause you got a little you don't six. Rap, they ain't gonna do it. All right, well we gotta press the drop. We find a beat for for um T Black man, T Black over here. He need like a Kodak Black type beat. He need. A, you need a Kodak Black beat. <laughs> kind of beat you need? Well, I ain't about yeah. to freestyle, but you got it. You ain't about to freestyle? You want me to freestyle? Yeah, you can freestyle, though. No, man. If I freestyle, you definitely got to go for it. I ain't to freestyle for it. No, no. I was a rap. You the one promoting rap. Hey, I'm telling you, Tony Black finna blow up. Boy, y'all better keep a lookout on Tony this Black. Dude, you can't oh, trust this dude, man. This man. <laughs> Why you keep saying you can't trust him, man, man? Man, you trust him. You trust Man, look at it. You don't, you trust the Smurf? <laughs> you trust him, I'm with you. Right. <laughs> I was just saying, if you trust him, I'm with you. I was, hey, man, that man brought you in here and went off on your fanny pack. You know, first quarter. I ain't even call it that, though. Nah, you ain't call he it that. He fucked it you up call by calling it that. What you called it? <laughs> a but pouch. It's, it's, that's what it's called, man. That bit called a pouch. It's called a fanny pack. Bro. So if you, you look like it up on shit. Amazon, try to buy it, or go to the website, it say fanny pack. What it say? He ain't, Jordan he don't pouch. know he got it as a gift. Man, don't buy that shit, man. That nigga just put his belongings in there. That shit work. It little trick pack. <laughs> <laughs> he be tricky. He got a little trick pack. Like, <laughs> I need one of those shits. <laughs> I be seeing yeah. them at the park, man. You, know you got rubbers saying? in there? At least you got to have some nah. rubbers in there. You don't got no protection in there? Nah, bro. I can't this nigga don't got no protection. Out, this nigga don't got no fire. This nigga don't got no rubbers. This nigga just got two faces and mouthwash. <laughs> I don't even... Man, never mind. And some blunts. You smoke? That, you got some blunts in there? Nah. You got no blunts. <laughs> you don't got a little drink. I don't drink. Oh, he don't drink, so he ain't got a little, little, yeah, little. How old are you? Are you old enough to drink? Yeah, I'm 21. Oh, okay. Man, 21, man. 21 on this shit, man. Hey, man, we gonna see, see if bro know who, uh, what you call it is. Who? A ball. You know A ball is? You don't know A ball is? I never Told heard you, bro. It. You never heard of A ball? <laughs> Told you. MJG? <laughs> you never heard of A ball. Dang, that's crazy. That music Who is that? You don't know that? A-Ball, NJG? 
I can't even describe them right now. Like <laughs> they just like one of the MCs like from from the south. All right, so no trick. No trick daddy. No trick daddy. Yeah. All right. No. What's the what, artist? one of his songs? Man. Um, <laughs> oh, holiday, oh, right, oh, right, right. oh, yeah. nah, 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 you can't do that old you can't do that old God damn, boy. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, my heart in my chest, <laughs> You know Trick. Trick got a lot of them. Right, well, he came out with Thug Holiday. Yeah, that's one of the hardest ones. Yeah, it is, really. Yeah, I fought with it. What song you like on Thug Holiday? The album. Mm-hmm. That's the album. I don't know about all that. You don't know the song? About the song. I didn't know. I'm talking about the song. I ain't know what the song. Album. Huh? Uh, holiday. But you don't know the song, Thaw Holiday. Oh, you didn't like the song? <laughs> yeah. That's the only song you know? Yeah, but I don't listen to him. You know the album. He got an album called Thug Holiday. Yeah, that's what I thought you were talking about, Thug Holiday, the album. He talking about the track. He talking he, about I the track. I don't think he, he know even about listen the album. to the song. He got all the hardest songs on that bit. Back in the day, well, you know, I can't teach you, man. Back in the day. <laughs> no, I can't hey. teach you. No, you know, was, AK, that was on no. Yeah, that was on, was on um, www.com. Yeah, that was. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. 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 It was on there. Back in the day. All right, damn, you don't know about Tree. You from Florida? What about JT Money? Hey. <laughs> I don't know about the old ass people, man. All right, so what? So what artist you came up on? Huh? What artist you came up on? There you go. What What inspired you to want to rap? What artist? The artist? Nah, you don't even know. Like you NBA up. young boy. Damn, niggas. And he fresh. Oh, nigga that's said. like. That's, yeah, but this boy. the this the new bro. That's the, nah, nah. Before NBA young boy, you gotta have somebody before, before NBA, NBA young, young boy. boy. Yeah. I'll probably say like the hot boy or something. All right, all right, yeah. Hot boys oh, after yeah. young boy though. He no, said hot no, boy. No, I said before. No, hot before boy, not NBA. Hot boy. Oh, hot boy. Okay, okay, okay. okay <laughs> he okay. said hot boy. You talking about cash, cash money? money. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. I ain't hear the ass. Hot boys was a that's that's a good pick. Bro. Yeah, yeah, what? That's a good pick. Especially for his ah, age. Damn. So so you up on the old Lil Wayne? Nah, I don't really, I don't really catch him like that stuff, bro. All right, so what you listen to? I listen to young I mean, boy. I listen to young, young boy, boy and I listen to Rod Wave. Hot boy all of them. I'm talking about like. When oh, that's another up. thing. I'm talking about when Hot boy posted up. him. That's another one. He was like, "Say that shit," because you deleted the video. No, no, he deleted the video. You posted it on your page though, didn't you? Oh yeah, I did delete that bit too. So what was it? I seen this shit. It was funny as fuck. And then Hot that boy, Hot repo- boy he posted yeah. it. Cause I think that song "Don't Need Time." Don't need time. Yep. Say, go ahead. Yeah, and the everybody, verse. And everybody was like, um, it was like a three point five time. Everybody wrote a three. Wow. And I was like, I ain't listen to that shit no more because he got me smoking up all my weed. Because, <laughs> you know, he said three, five to make my blind high, some shit. Yeah, so he was, the whole he was joint, like, the yeah, whole, I ain't listening to that hot boy set. no more, man. That shit had me rolling up my whole, <laughs> whole sack up, man. And then he posted it. <laughs> you rolling up the whole 3.5. <laughs> For real. Uh, that influence, <laughs> hey Snoop. Yeah, yeah. Like everybody was in the music. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, yeah. Was doing it. Well, it's the high influence high. in the music. Hot boy tongue. Hey, I fuck with Hot boy. I fuck with Hot up. boy music too. He got he got some straight <laughs> content in his music. I forgot to say Hot boy one. Yeah, he doing his thing right now. He, he, he yeah, what? Yeah, yeah, I fuck with his music. He got Honey K. Hey, he it ain't doing too, his it thing. Ain't too many. There ain't too many niggas rolling three fives. If you rolling the three fives, you got to <laughs> If you rolling the three fives, you sell weed. Listen, I don't even smoke weed. I'm, tell I'm you, trying I'm to tell imagine you, I'm that I'm whole 3.5 in that bitch. That's a big-ass blunt, boy. If you rolling roll three fives, you sell weed. You smoke <laughs> that? You put that in your blunt? <laughs> he was. You did? Yeah, he was like, I ain't yeah. listening to One Hot time, Boy no more. Because every you time I listen to him. You fuck what it was? Regular or Zy? Yeah, it's loud. I'm smoking it down regular. I'm talking about his Zyle is just some, what it was. Yeah, regular loud. Some platinum. Some regular platinum, some what? Some OG or some Zyle, like some. Probably some OG. Probably some OG. Yeah. How much you pay for it? Hmm? How much you pay for it? Pay for they. 25. Oh, yeah, that was some regular <laughs> shit. That was some regular shit. 25? That was some regular shit. You ain't, you ain't want to go in your ass. You're going to pay about 35, 40, or 50. You're going to go in your ass. 
Like, you definitely would have rolled up that much. Yeah. 75, ain't it? <laughs> like, he don't even want that. He would have really, he would have rolled that up and went to sleep. Give him that lava cake. <laughs> that nigga try to put him to sleep with the, the white the runs. <laughs> Man, he ain't gonna do nothing but take pictures of that all day. But that's what it was. He was like, man, I ain't listening to Hot Boy no more because every time I listen to him, I roll up all my weed. That's what that shit was funny as fuck. He got, I ain't gonna lie, man. I listen to your jokes. You got some punchlines on the jokes, man. <laughs> he just scared to come out the house with it. <laughs> Can't be having the Twitter fingers, man. You gotta come out the house, man. Put that shit on blast. Stand uh, up. What you, what, 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 bro, what, what you doing, like? One that yeah, like, different market, that's man. Gonna, I that's keep gonna, y'all. that's gonna get you. That's gonna get you on um, better too, cause like that go for everything. If you trying to be a fighter, you gotta go fight a bitch. You really <laughs> want to know how to fight? Yeah. So it's like keep coming at a motherfucker. Eventually, bitch gonna feel you. Bitch gonna. Yeah. That boy went there. He went that ring. Yeah, he went. At, he went at a, a real one. Jet yeah, retarded. Like, with retarded. I'm like, yeah. You gotta keep going at Randy, boy. He gonna respond. You keep going there, he gonna respond. It's like the first fight, you coming for the belt. <laughs> Yeah, first that's fight. what I said. That nigga went at, He was like, that was the first time you did it? Yeah, he was just playing. Well, you got off, bro. <laughs> he got off. For the first. <laughs> but Randy ain't going to respond to him because he know what he doing. He's like, all right, he trying to shoot to get some clout. So he's like, I ain't going to shoot back. But you keep yeah, going you keep at him. You keep shooting at his ass, he going to shoot. That's why I said way, you uh, got to pull up. DC and uh, you Kevin Hart up, did. Man. You, oh, you seen up. that? That's the situation. I'll tell you about that. Want me to come with you? i go with you to Broadway, man. We go out there, pull up with the cameras. Just go on, fire Randy ass. Nigga, I'm gonna fire your ass up. That shit, Randy. All right, now. You you think you ready to step in that pit? Yeah, you fire his ass up. Only thing you can do is lose. You still gonna get (laughs) publicity. All all good, bad, all that shit is gonna work. It don't matter. You gonna fire your ass. You gonna fire your ass up. (laughs) You wanna go? Oh. I want to go. Now, don't leave me stuck. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't going to, I don't crack joke. I don't, don't have me out there ready to shoot my ass So They ain't going to be something. It's going to be a whole different, I don't crack jokes. <laughs> you going to go to a whole different flip mode. I'd put you out there. You got to fire his ass up. You're going to fire him up. We're going to have to kill people. You say, yeah? Yeah, we can. All right, we're going to put this shit together, man. We're going to... I love we're, that, man. I love I, that, man. We're going to go to Brown. We're going to go looking for Randy. I'm going to call him. Hey, man, we pulling up. I'm going to fire your ass up. Now, you fire your ass up. You just going to go home with the L. You just work on your jokes. No. <laughs> oh, he really fire. Oh, he really went at Randy. I don't think it's gonna be a fair uh, fight. <laughs> uh, Oh, go live. We are, we live. We live. We gonna finna go at Randy, man. What you talking about, man? I got my dog, man. What's your name? Tony Black. Tony Black, <laughs> man. We coming, man. Orlando. Bro, you be doing skits, too. How you be doing them skits? I don't know, man. I might How you come take, up with them skits? I had to take food with me, man. You them was skits. like, you gonna fold, boy. I didn't boy. think about it, bro. The, uh, <laughs> with you and your pops, I seen that one. <laughs> they played you, <laughs> and then you dressed up as your pops. That shit was kind of funny. Oh, you don't dress up like my deal. We I say keep going, bro. Keep doing that yeah, shit. Yeah, I like. I think. I think you go on the comedian too. I'm rocking with. I'm, I'm rocking with that. I ain't just. I ain't just talking. He looking at me like man, this nigga cracking jokes. I ain't. I ain't cracking jokes. I'm serious. With the comedian jump, the rap. No, no, man. Man, you crazy, bro. Why you <laughs> talking about my rap, bro? Because that shit, that shit will fire. The hook will fire, but you stop, man. You're like, you ain't respecting the fan base. Niggas listening to that shit, my radio stop. Pissed off. <laughs> I ain't got no explanation. I don't want to listen to this artist no more. <laughs> The fuck so what First you impression is, is everything. I ain't going to lie. Huh? So what you saying is I got to make my songs longer. Nah, not even longer. Just if you're gonna stop that shit, just stop that shit after the hook. Don't come on no bars and you just run out of thought. And then you just like, all right, that's it, producer. You 
next week. Done. It's over with. I'm tired. Constructive <laughs> criticism. Nothing there else. Go. I got nothing else. Bro, you, you, you win a half a ball right now. <laughs> you should turn the engineer. I'm really mad at the engineer for even letting you leave the studio. Like no, that. tell him. Oh, oh nah, you can't even go. Oh, you did that in your house? Oh, no. I did that off my Oh, all right. <laughs> all right. That makes sense because I'm finna be mad at the engineer. Like, you don't tell this man, bro, you, it ain't That's even a whole <clears throat> bar, bro. Get your ass back in the booth and come up with something. <laughs> I I'm glad you are gonna see the growth, bro. Just remember all right. this. That's all I can all right, say. I fuck with you, then. You did it out of your room. You can't, you know, do what we want to do. Radio, man. Tony Black. First, you first heard him here, out the room, off the phone. Eighteen and a half balls. <laughs> <laughs> straight off, straight off the muscle, man. Any, and right now we got the pressure on. I don't know why we put this together with the pressure, but that was Miss Bree's fault. Y'all take the blame, man. It was yeah, just, man, I'm bringing it. Was, it was he should have came amateur night. He got two different. Uh, he come on amateur, amateur night, man. Amateur <laughs> Apollo, man. He don't come on no damn the pressure, man. He bring somebody that got bars, man. He got, oh. <laughs> hey, oh. nigga, the mic right there, shit. Oh, I don't rap. What the fuck? Man, you ain't got no gun in your so. fanny pack, man. You can't scare me, man. You ain't got no gun. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't scared. Now you, now you ain't tell me what's in the fanny pack, I'll probably stop. <laughs> but you ain't got nothing in the fanny pack. I'm going to keep going. I'm going to keep going. I'm going to got hot. Yo. 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 Say one more thing about my boss. <laughs> Oh yeah, man. My son, he all he, and he, shit coming yeah. to it, man. Don't Sorry, don't safety. book people on Friday. You gonna go to the Jones game <laughs> and then come here? Yeah, I was supposed to be at that bill. Yeah, this nigga is Sorry, perfect. Nigga, right here. Why you they don't care, Jones? Man, they ain't gonna do him like that. You ain't gonna do him like that. All right, Please man. spare me, man, because I don't. All right, man, we do. I know too much, man. I got. We got. Saved. We got one more for, for the pressure. Market. We got one more, and we got one more for the pressure. Um, we gotta give it one more, man. We would have spared you, but some of the people can listen. He got eighteen <laughs> balls. We can't run no more. His track. Who? He? Oh, eat. Eat. He. No, the eat. It's a track eat. called eat. Oh, know? eat. Oh yeah, let me hear that. That shit sound like some competitive shit. Yeah. It's a video, actually. All right, we coming with Eat, man. My dog Tony Black gonna come back to the show and he gonna write. He gonna finish his bars, man. I get off the weight, all of these flavors, pack full of 
skittles Dump with the paper, then wrap them and sell them You can come get it, that's a take that I pay a little extra, that's a livery Wrong plugged in with the shelf though I'm the man, you and I middle me Ay, I get that food from the source uh, Nigga, my tab is a Porsche Pockets be dead as a corpse uh, Stuck to the cold like Morse Coming for seconds and thirds Serena and Venus, I serve uh, Too many people be popping them out Me, I be into the verbs I'm trying to eat, I'm not into snacking Defense are in, I'm in the second You want it catered, then send me the backing Uber Eats, I send you the track Everything on top, on to the front You'll get your collard greens When you send them croissants New money, new hood, new haters New chef, new spot, new flavors I'ma invest in some papers Everybody eat, got plates on the table Tell all my niggas That was that pressure. That yeah, one was so, uh, so, danger. That was called E E E E A T. All right, man, y'all, man, we about to let out, man. Y'all go ahead and let the people know how to find y'all. What it is, what it is, it pressure, y'all, man. Instagram, the only pressure. No special spelling, just the only pressure. Uh, Facebook, pressure Dharma. Uh, YouTube, go type in pressure Dharma. That's P R E S S U R E. D O M M E R, um, just play around for the new music. Apple Music, I got I got music on Apple Music as well. So if you search my name, everything gonna pop pop up. Just Google me, basically. Man, it's T Black, man. You can uh, find me on Instagram at Tony Black fourteen K. All right, and you already know what to do, man. Intervision TV, man. Do what you want to do. Radio, man. We out. Yo. Yeah, Matt said he gonna